Texas Tech. This is Miss Sosa. Today is Friday. So it is Friday, April 17th, 2020. I'm so excited because today you guys start your box book. Okay, so you guys have been doing an amazing job. And now look at yourselves. You're already in our second storybook. So awesome job, guys. Awesome job. Kiss your brains. You guys are so smart. Today we're going to be doing lesson 84. Okay? So let's sit up tall. Let's go ahead and start. Hands on knees. We're tracking the speaker and we're talking big. There we go. Now, look at these letters. You know the names of the letters that are in red. Get ready to tell me those letters. Get ready. A. Get ready. E. Get ready. I. Get ready. O. Get ready. U. Yes, good job saying the names of the letters in red. Now it's my turn to say the names of all the letters. Here we go, pay attention. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Good job, boys and girls. Now, one more time, you guys are going to say them with me. Okay? Here we go. Get ready. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Good job, boys and girls. Don't forget to practice your alphabet at home saying the letter names, okay? Now listen, first you're going to read the underlined part, then you're going to read the whole word. Look at the underlined part. Tell me the underlined part. Get ready. Say the whole word. Get ready. Them. Tell me the underlined part. Get ready. What word? Why? Tell me the underlying parts. Get ready. Ooh. What word? What? Tell me the underlying parts. Get ready. All. Now say the whole word. Get ready. Wall. Tell me the underlying parts. Get ready. Ooh, what word? Where? Tell me the underlying parts. Get ready. Ow. What word? Around. Tell me the underlying parts. Get ready. R. Now say the whole word. Get ready. Arm. Now we're going to read the column the fast way. A little bit faster, make sure you're moving your mouth and you look at my finger. Get ready. Them. Get ready. Why? Get ready. What? Get ready. Wall. Get ready. Where? Get ready. Around. Last word. Get ready. Arm. Good job, boys and girls. Now I'll read the words in red. This word is two. What word? Two. 
This word is thunder. What word? Thunder. Now we're going to read the whole poem the fast way. Get ready. Two. Get ready. Thunder. Think of the end of the word. Get ready. Tape. You should be moving your mouth. Get ready. Cap. Get ready. Hope. Get ready. Gabe. Get ready. Cape. Last word, move your mouth. Get ready. Mess. Good job reading the whole column the fast way. You're going to read this column the fast way. Make sure you guys are also looking at the end of the word. Get ready. Hate. Get ready. Tap. Get ready. Hat. Get ready. Hop. Get ready. When. Move your mouth. Get ready. Hitting. Last word. What word? Who? Good job, boys and girls. Now, first you're going to read the underlying part. Then you're going to read the whole word. Read the underlying part. Get ready. Other. I'll say the whole word. Get ready. Another. Tell me the underlying part. Get ready, walk. Now say the whole word. Get ready, walked. Tell me the underlying part. Get ready, smile. Now say the whole word. Get ready, smiled. Read the underlying part. Get ready, hop. Now say the whole word. Get ready, hopped. Tell me the underlined part. Get ready, tap. Now say the whole word. Get ready, tapped. Tell me the underlined part. Get ready, came. Now say the whole word. Get ready, Became. Tell me the underlying part. Get ready. Smile. Now say the whole word. Get ready. Smiled. Now we're going to do the whole column the fast way a little bit faster. Get ready. Another. Get ready. Walk. Get ready, smiles. Get ready, hopped. Get ready, tapped. Get ready, became. Last word. Get ready, smiles. Good job reading the words the fast way. Last column, we are reading it the fast way. Make sure we're moving our mouth and we're looking at the end of the word. Get ready. Miles. Get ready. Hole. Get ready. Broke. Get ready. Door. Get ready. Pow. Get ready. Again. Last word, think big. Get ready. Yes, 
were. Good job reading the words of fast faith in your brain. You guys are so smart. This time you guys can go ahead and press pause, get your box book, and you're going to go to page one, the first story of your box book. It should be story 84. When you're ready, go ahead and press play and put your fingers under the first word of the item. Let's read. Get ready. If the teacher says for, say of. Let's read it the fast way. Get ready. If the teacher says for, say of. Let's play the game. What are you going to say when I say for? Get ready. Of. When are you going to say of? Get ready. Yes. When the teacher says for. Let's play the game. For. Yes. One more time. For. Of. Good reading. Uh, good reading the item, boys and girls. Good doing what the teacher is asking you to do. All right. Put your finger into the first word of the title. Let's read it. Get ready. Don is a super man. Read the title the fast way. Get ready. Don is a superman. Yes, good reading, boys and girls. Finger under the first word of the of the story. Get ready. Who gave Don a dime? Who gave Don a who gave Don a dime? Get ready. A woman. Next, get ready. Where was the woman with the cape and the cap. So where was the woman with the cape and the cap? Down the stairs. Yes. Let's continue. Get ready. How could the Don be a superman? How could Don be a superman? Tap the dime three times. Good. Let's continue. Get ready. Don said, I hope this works. Then he tapped the dime. One time, two times, three times. There was the sound of thunder. Boom. What was that? Don asked. He looked at his hand. The dime was still there. Then Don saw that he had a cape and a cap. So what happened? He became a superman. Yes. Let's continue. Get ready. Wow, Don said. When I tapped that dime, I became a superman. Don said, I must keep this dime. I will tape it to my arm. And he did. What did he do with the dime? Tape it to his arm. Let's continue and get ready. Then he, turn the page. Finger in the first word, continue. Said, now I will see if I am a superman. Don kicked the wall. How? He made a big hole in the wall. Don smiled. Wow, he said. I am a super man. He hopped around the store. He hit the wall again. Pow! He made another hole in the wall. Now there were two holes in the wall. Don hopped around the 
cat shop hitting things. He said, I hate cats. What did he say? I hate cats. Continue. Pow. He hit a hat box and made a hole in it. Then he said, I hate mops. So he broke the mop. What did he do? Broke the mop. Continue. Get ready. This is fun, he said. By now, the store was a mess. There were holes in the wall. The hats had holes in them. The doors had holes in them. Don said, no one can stop me now. I am a superman. To be continued. So now you're going to go ahead and follow me. I'm going to go ahead and read this story to you guys once. So go ahead and go to the first page and put your finger on the title. Follow along as I read. It says, Don is a superman. Who gave Don a dime? Where was the woman with a cape and cap? How could Don be a superman? Don said, I hope this works. Then he tapped the dime one time, two times, three times. There was a sound of thunder. Boom. What was that? Don asked. He looked at his hand. The dime was still there. Then Don saw that he had a cape and a cap. Wow, Don said. When I tapped that dime, I became a superman. Don said, I must keep this dime. I will tape it to my arm. And he did. Then he turn the page, finger into the first word, said, now I will see if I am a superman. Don kicked the wall. How? He made a big hole in the wall. Don smiled. Wow, he said, I am a superman. He hopped around the store. He hit the wall again. How? He made another hole in the wall. Now there were two holes in the wall. Don hopped around the hat shop, hitting things. He said, I hate hats. How? He hit a hat box and made a hole in it. Then he said, I hate mops. So he broke them up. This is fun, he said. By now the store was a mess. There were holes in the wall. The hats had holes in them. The doors had holes in them. Don said, no one can stop me now. I am a superman. To be continued. Boys and girls, was Don doing good things? Nope. Look at the picture. How many holes do you see in the wall? There's two in the wall. How many do you see? Where else do you see holes? In the door. In, looks like a hat, a trash can. Yes. And what is he holding? A broken broom. Mop. A mop. He, he hated mops, remember? Yes. So we are done with today's story. Don't forget to do your worksheet 84, the front and the back. Also, like always, here's a few um, next steps. Read each story, well, not each story, read story 84 two more times. Make sure you take a picture of your exit ticket, which is page 84, questions one through eight. All right, see you guys next week.